Hello and welcome to Fern, the eighth tiny home by Made Relative Tiny Homes. This home was inspired by the Pacific Northwest with its cool and fresh colors. And first thing you'll notice is that we have nice slate gray blue cabinetry um, that is really adaptable, but also a nice color piece. In the kitchen, there's a full sink with a kitchen window and a full range stove and oven with a small fridge that fits nicely into the space. Across from the kitchen is the stairs and the bar, which looks out this beautiful large window. And there's windows above, which provide a lot of light for this tiny space. On the other side of the house is the living area, which has a desk to the left, right beside the full-size couch, which can also be used for guest uh, sleeping. It's blue and velvet, really beautiful. Across from the couch is the entertainment center. And then above the living area is a twin-size loft. Underneath the bar, we store this ladder that is used to get up into the twin loft. And then another key feature of the living area is there is storage underneath the full-size couch. One key feature of Made Relative Tiny Homes is the spacious storage underneath every step. It's really nice and allows you to be discreet with your storage and keep everything tidy. We're also really proud of our ability to provide locally sourced live edge wood throughout the tiny home, on the bar, in the living area, in the kitchen, and upstairs in the loft and in the bathroom. Up here in the loft, it fits a queen size bed. It has lots of windows to keep it bright and sunny. And then in the corner there, it has a reading light and some live edge shelving. The loft gives a great view of the house, looking down into the kitchen and the bar to the right, the living area, all the way on the other side with the twin loft on top. In the bathroom, we have this beautiful vessel sink with lots of counter space, a corner for whatever kind of toilet you would like, with a shelf, and then a large spacious shower. Across from the shower in the large cabinet is the hot water heater. And then underneath the counter is a spot for an all-in-one washer and dryer. 